Ah, uh, once again, we start again. I'm so frustrated. Okay, I'm back to her because the inability to heal is too crippling. I just get hit too often. And I can't pull over and get to the strength level I need to be to keep going. So, we're her again. I just, we're going to keep trying. Bang my head against the ground. <laughs> Ah, we we're on the way. I did change that the palm tree guards are off. I know I'm probably playing on easy mode, but if you think it's easy for me, you're nuts. I think my record on the game itself is well over a thousand days. And on this thing, I'm lucky I can make it 10. It's so much meaner. It cares less about my happiness. All right, human. Let's get going. We're going to figure it out. I don't know how, but we're going to figure this out. <laughs> oh, I'm a tragedy. All right, once again. Settling in. We start with the surfboard. This is good. I'm starting to think the pelican is cursed. I'm not quite ready to commit to it, but there's a, there's a little bit of reality to that, right? Pelican's a little bit cursed. Maybe evil. Possibly. I don't know. If I die right after getting that pelican another time, I'm going to go bananas. This means we go back to the original farms, which, might I add, I really approve of the original farms, and I actually greatly dislike the, uh, the change in the farming, because I think it's too time-consuming for what it is. Uh, I play a pretty heavy game. I have four people, and you basically have to dedicate one person to the farming. Which is another reason why I ended up playing the little plant man. Because the amount of time you committed to the farming was just unbelievable. Completely unrealistic and unnecessary. So there are lots of little things that won't won't bother us now, including the fact that I can pick flowers and they improve my sanity instead of decrease my sanity. I can cut down trees with zero punishment. These are all little little fun things that you can't do as Captain Plant. But Again, I can't grow food as easily. I just... I don't know if in this game that helps you. I don't know if that's really helping you. Like, I'm way more willing to fight this snake. Because I know I can get that health back. It's not as punishing or completely unachievable. Don't get me wrong. I don't love lo losing health. But it helps a lot. Only one at a time. Ouch. There we go. Ha ha! Now every time I eat cooked food, I can gain that back. So I, I, I'm not as worried about getting in those fights. I just don't want a yellow snake, because then I got big trouble. The only poison I got rid of is just the poison gas clouds, and that's just because I find it to be very slow. Every other poison thing, poison snakes, and so on, that's all still in here, so. The seal, NATO, and the tree guards are pretty much what I cleaned up. There's still tiger sharks and plenty of other problems floating around. My new method, reap the land. Take it all, pull it up. There we go. To kind of wait for them to just decide to dance around. Day one, establishing. Obviously I'd love a backpack, but we all know the limitations there.
just got the chimney. I'm so mad. I, it was a good start. It's good. It was a good getting off the ground. But we'll go faster this time. Feeling pretty good that I can scout out very differently with her. And as much as I never want to admit that my little plant man is anything but amazing, I don't think this is where he's meant to be. At his difficulty level, I'm not ready to win. <laughs> he tried. He was there for me. Efforts were made. Be someone a little bit more designed for the environment. If I was playing more than one person, though, I think I'd absolutely just be the plant guy. But of course, Clay will never make this two-player. And that's just selfish and mean of them. I, I wanted this to be two-player for a long time. A friend of mine and I... Um, play this game a lot and both talked about how this would be the most wild two-player going. Oh, it's like the sounds of their neck snapping. It's gross noises. Making sure I got lots of rock, lots of wood, lots of everything. It's a little weird not to just jump out into the ocean, but I do think this is probably the best plan. Is just get yourself a bit set up, so when you do find gold, you're ready to rock. Put that there for a second. I like to trade you for probably one of those I'll get my chance at those later all right cooking up some food see if I can just re Create health. That's huge. I'll wait for night and hope that I catch some of these birds. If you catch them in the blackness, they'll go to sleep and then you can finish them off. You've seen me do that in a video. So sometimes you just kind of want to let that happen. Aw, no fair. Well, that's alright. We're waiting for night anyways. Alright. Let's go this way today. I'm feeling warm that direction. We have some food. Cook some stuff off. Even though the monster meat makes you mental... In the early days, it's still food. You can't burn it. You know when you just have like a bad thought and you're like, is that something I could do by accident? Because that feels like a bad thing that I could do by accident. Alright, launch. Come on. Launch! Off we go. Of course I'm going against the waves today. Try to keep the surfboard alive for a little while. Eat our egg. We start with green space right away. Can I not plant the 
That's interesting. You can't plant those on green space. Huh. I'm not really complaining as much as I'm just feeling very informed. All right. No, off and retrieve. Retrieve. Thank you. Mandrake hanging out here. Don't really want to pick him. Not yet. Jungle could be gold. Speak of the devil. Okay, good. I do need another one of those. All I want for Christmas is a backpack. A backpack. A backpack. All I want for Christmas is a backpack. Man, am I not kidding? Do I ever want a backpack? Let's just fix this now. Thank you. Let's fix this world. Ah, oh, backpack. It's a better place. solve all of my problems in life? No. Does it solve the backpack problem in my life? Yes, it does. Alright. Pitchfork. I'm out of sticks. Time to get sticks. That is a weird spit of land. I mean... Okay, okay, but oh. mangrove. Let's throw these here. Hmm. A lack of sticks could be accused of being a bad thing. You can't build a torch without sticks. Can't remember. I still build a fire because it's mostly grass, but. Uh, it's not a good thing to be without sticks. Come on, everybody. Through the woods. Okay, teamwork is cheating. So you killed a butterfly. I was gonna kill it. But you know when you do it it's evil. Lots of butterflies. Wow. I did not turn that up. Sort of seems to be the way it's working out. No sticks means I'm not going out on the water at night because obviously I can't handle it properly. Fight the guy! Come on! Pain in my... <laughs> I know there's a hotkey button for this, but do you think I know it? None. Fine, go chase the butterfly. Yeah, I gotta stop fighting snakes and start eating cooked food, because now I'm just getting myself in trouble. Well, grass I'm not lacking. But we're definitely going to have to do something about twigs. The 
can't make any more tools. Believe it or not, I consider that to be a problem. Uh, I guess we'll take this guy. He's just gonna cheap at us until morning. We'll pick him in the light and he'll just quietly pass away. Which is so morbid. This will make me 29. Ooh, 32. It gave me four? Really? Can't remember the butterflies do anything for me. They do. Wow. Thanks. My food is nice. I'll cook this so it doesn't make me crazy on the high seas. I'll cook this just in case I need emergency food. I know he's annoying. I honestly, in the moment I picked it, I went, I should have waited to pick it. Oh, well, we're in him now. Noisy little fella. There we go. There we go. And that's the end of that. No good without sticks. At least I have a backpack. And I'm not bold and brave enough to say no to food, so don't mind me as I pull over. Gold is a win. That's a merm. Let's just do this and hope that... Time to go looking for a pelican. The cursed object. If you can't tell, this is the biome that these things live on. A totally normal tree. Maybe not big enough for a pelican drop? I don't know. Not seeing anything. Spiders are kind of a nice find. If I had a spear. Still no sticks. up a butterfly meal. Seriously, no sticks? An unexpected and bizarre problem. Weird. Alright. We either find something or we have to turn around because I got no light sources on this ocean. Now I don't want to stop for food because I don't want to waste the time we've got to find an island. Hoping we just get lucky and there's another one almost instantly. Like that! Okay, money will rain from the sky! Just saying it. Just in case you want to wish fulfillment there. Jungle. Miles of it.
Taking a risk. It's a big island. Big island, but I'm not seeing any sticks. And we really, like, need things like that. Remember what the fog does and transports you to the other side of the map. Can't remember. Gonna find out now. Yeah, you end up somewhere else. Which is fine. Exploration for the win. Now I'm gonna find an island because. Again, we have no source of light. Oh, well, it looks... Oh, it might just be shoal. Ah, failed survivor. Sit here and pick a shipwreck. I need an island. Or well, island. Ah, oh, the peace of the ocean. Oh, thank you. I was really worried I wasn't going to get one. This feels like one of those ones where it's very small. Nope. No good. And a stick. Thank y'all. I can build a shovel, which I think I'm gonna need because sticks are proving to be a problem. Time for a hammer. I want to tell you how long it took me to learn that's what that did. A lot longer than I'm emotionally comfortable admitting. Oops. Is there a pig king like creature that I give a can of silly string to? I don't think I've seen an item that felt very pig king ish before. I have no idea. There absolutely could be. I have no I have no proof against it. There we go. Looking good. make a science machine, but I don't think I'm going to drop it here. I think we're going to go looking around a little bit and just pick up some resources while we're here.
I don't want to say so far so good because I keep saying that and then we're dead. Three, two, one, I drop dead, which is not good. It's not making for great content. At least I'm, I, I don't know. I don't know what makes great content to you guys. You guys put up with me so much more than I expect you to put up with me. I don't know if I'd put up with me this much. I'm just saying. Nah, what are we kidding? We all put this on and stop paying attention. That's what life's about nowadays. Alright, let's go this way. Kind of going back the direction we started, but with a little bit more of the in-betweeny stuff. Still haven't found an island I'm in love with yet. Keep checking. Same island, different island. Same island. Hammer up all the good stuff. It's not helping anybody if it isn't helping you. Okay, that's not the worst island. Could live here. Don't hate it. Bang! Definitely working on the boards for the alchemy machine. Oh, do not hammer the surfboard. Bad game. Do not hammer the surfboard. saying I don't hate this tiny little this little island is kind of adorable we might live here it's a mangrove trees I don't see any bison though is it just the trees like there would be bison Just like an island that's very manageable. We're hurting for resources, so I'm not jumping to stop. If anybody's wondering why I'm not just establishing. Last time I had lots of gold. It helped a lot. Once again, money will rain from the sky. Just saying. Because the minute I keep saying, I need an X. The game's like, oh, you need an X. Well, here, have an X. You want gold? Psh, we can do gold. Why are you gonna make it sound so hard? Stop it. Okay, I want lots of gold, tons of it, and a pelican, and a and a slot machine. Anything else you can think of? Okay, <laughs> doing a little better for gold. Day four, and I don't hate it. Spiders are nice. 
Don't really... I'm not in the position to deal with them right now, but, you know, it's good to know they're out there. Go away. Out here, looking for more gold. This island is too much jungle. I don't want to live with this much nonsense. Big island. Jeez. Look at this thing. More gold! Hooray! Alright, we agreed. Lots of gold. And I'd like a slot machine, please. You guys don't know what that is yet. But we're gonna find one. I'm sure gonna try. Alright, eat a little food. While I have it, make a torch before I forget. The fire pre made, right? Nope. Do that while I'm there. Ah! Okay, technically you can get gears from this guy, but I am not a good enough combat. Guy to do that. They shoot bombs at you. They have their own goals. Some of their goals have to do with eating you. It's very special. Alright, let's go this way. Hey, we're going the way of the wind today. Woohoo! Island. And it's a bad island, too. But possibly a pelican island. Definitely a pelican island. Alright. Stop here. Just eat this so I have the open space. And stay away from the bad fish. Do me so much damage. Okay, as mentally unwell as this makes me sound, seeing Volcano and then this area kind of makes me want to live here. That is because this is much more manageable when it's not solely here. Uh, fish and poison. I don't need both. Let's go over this way and see if we can see the thing. It should be in there. I just don't see it. Of course, we ran down and died last time without seeing it. It should surprise very few. Oh, I don't see it here. Maybe not lucky. Maybe not this island. Yeah, we're gonna get away from the fish. This is nice. I don't hate this. I like this terrain. Oh, there's a whole nother side. Oh, weird. Alright. So you are in like a channel. I don't know. I kinda like it, but it sort of terrifies me. I don't know if I want to live near this much death. A little, little scary to move around my island. Ow! Go away! I'm not a hero. <clears throat> I can explore this island from the safety of my bunker here. We know what that fish hook looks like. Uh, 
I'm not seeing it. Doesn't mean it's not in there, but I'm sure not seeing it. Okay, well, this will give me a fair bit of gold, but we're going to have to cave and buy the science machine. Of course, there's quite a bit of just this stuff, so hooray for that. Like I said, that's living near a lot of death. I don't need to live near that much death. But I don't mind living death adjacent. You know, where I can visit it and snicker behind death's back. I'm starting to get enough gold to make it matter. I, I do like living near the pools, though. I mean, fish for eel and all that good stuff. There are reasons. There are things. Make this kind of stuff worthwhile. Alright, as crazy as I am, I don't need to live that close to death. Same island? No. There's a weird islands out here. No monkeys yet. Interesting. Woo! Message in a bottle. I want it. Alright, let's read it. Treasure be here. Treasure beware. Come on, out! Weird, it turned my map. Alright, treasure be there! I think that's a big island. <laughs> Empty bottle taking up space! Well, now we're doing good for gold. Which is good. There's lots of things we want to make out of gold. Not sad. Not a bad thing. Just want to find somewhere to live now. Darkness soon. The poor dead survivors just hanging out. Not looking good. I don't want to keep walking past dead guys, you know? It just feels like a bad island. Full of dead people. Yuck. Alright, keeping an eye on the night. Just kind of want to find a beach. Surfboard's getting kind of rough and ugly. Maybe it's because we've been cruising all over the ocean in it. It's only day five. It's looking pretty good. Nope, oh, trunk. Throw this in here. Take those. I'll take one of those. Stand in the bioluminescence for a minute. And try not to die. All 
right. Winds have changed. Let's find a beach. Oh, is that the edge again? Yeah. Uh-oh. Yep. Cutting that one a little close. Uh-oh. Now where am I? Oh, I'm way up here. All right. As good as anywhere else. We want to explore this place. This is definitely the way. <laughs> Just keep bouncing clear across the islands. Probably getting to be time for a new surfboard, though. Getting pretty ugly. And the waves are bad up here. Yeah, I'm aware. That ain't doing good. My mouse there and keep an eye on it. Let's go inland and hope we find something soon. 29. Every time I think I'm doing good, you know? Get myself into this nonsense. Twenty-seven. I mean, I guess technically I can build a boat while I'm on the water, so... Twenty-six. We'll see what happens first. This looks like could be land ho. Getting out of deep water is a good start. Hey, water bison. Ebro. Ebro. Way two. It's just a giant mangrove. Oh, I can make another surfboard. Okay, well, instead of making this just unnecessarily scary. Come on, just hop! Thank you. Just get off the terror bus. Look at this. Oh, that's different. I've never seen that before. Hmm. Interesting. No island, though. I didn't expect to go that far down without really hitting an island. Now that we're no longer taking on water every nine seconds, let's go back this way and suss it out a bit. Because that's a long way to go without an island. Or at least without a something. Nothing. I set my map to huge, but maybe it just gives me lots of open water. I don't really know the the metrics. I thought I saw light water. Mangrove and a beach. Oh my god. The slot machine. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. And there's a treasure chest right there. 
Amazing. All right, we're doing it. Also, always walk back because it will spit out monsters. Like that one. That's going to be monsters. Which is fine, but you don't want to be right next to it when it happens. Come on, game! That hitbox, man. That thing is nasty. Alright, because I will... Even if I don't live here, I will always want to come back and visit. We'll do some food. We'll do some health. Why well, you don't stand too close when you do this? Walking cane. Oh my god. Best gift ever. Thank you, machine. I live here. I live here. Even though I live next to this. And this dead guy. I think we'll call him Francis. Hi, Francis. And this dead guy. You don't get a name. No head, no name. And some gold. And some more gold. I have a walking stick, so everything in life is amazing. I live here. It is my lucky day. You better believe it. Oh, I love it. Okay, so in case I haven't made this clear, I live here. Move away from that. Ooh, food. Grass payout. Interesting. I know I haven't had all of these kind of things happen, because I don't always have this many coins. And there are lots of things that can... Come out of this thing. Ah! Like that. That was not nice. I don't want monkeys. I wreck where I live. Now I gotta kill monkeys. Later. Alright. Whatever, whatever I get, maybe it'll kill the monkeys. Okay, well that'll help me fight the monkeys. So, thank you. Let's uh, let's set up some house. It's a good helmet. First we need one of these. Chest must be under survival. Structures? Structures. Chest. Build chest. There's things here I just don't want to deal with. But I still need them. Get some food going. find some materials so we can build the better alchemy machine. This one. Alright, four wood. Monkey. Not even fair. Just mean. All the things. It's gotta be monkeys. It's because I said there were no monkeys, isn't it? I'm being now actively punished. All right, four boards. Three more. Which I don't have. At least they can't take stuff out of the chest. That that would tip me over the edge. I'm going to be honest. And it is only two of them. So at some point, I will just kill monkeys. Which feels mean, but I tell you, it's it's for the betterment of all.
They don't want to live on my island. My island's gonna be full of things. Like monkey killing machines. Swear to God, monkey, I'm prepared to kill you now, but my health's a little low. I'll come back for you. Alright, I got one more spin at the dice. Oh, bad one. No, oh, dogs! Can the dogs fight the monkeys? Dogs are worse. In case anybody's wondering, dogs are worse. Are they? Uh, now I'm conflicted. I don't like the dogs, but I really don't like the monkeys. Now I'm really hoping that the dogs and the monkeys are fighting. Where did the other dog go? Alright. Come here, monk! Enough of you on my island. I'm a force to be reckoned with! Monkey murder time! Come back here! You no longer live on my island in peace and harmony! Come on, I dare ya. Come on down. I got a craving for monkey meat. Oh yeah? Yeah, you wanna get uppity about it? Bring it on, monkey. I'm ready when you are. You'll forget, and that'll be when I finish you. This is silly. You'll sleep, monkey. You'll sleep. I'll be here, waiting, craving monkey meat. <laughs> All right, back to the show. Ah, <laughs> uh, where were we? Boards. There he is. Ah, oh, that one tastes sweeter than dead monkey. Delicious. Hey Francis, you proud of me? Killed two monkeys today. Feel pretty good about it, I'm just saying. Alright. 
what else we got? Two more boards. Refined material. One, two. Better science machine. Yes. All right, in the nature of science, let's get a lightning rod before awful stuff happens to me. Come on, I know you're in here. Rainometer. Okay, let's come up and refine. I know it's one more cut stone and then it's gold, so it'll be in here. There it is. Before terrible things happen to me. Alright, I don't need this. There we go. <sighs> Feeling pretty good about things. Shovel time. And pitchfork. When our spear passes away. That's our spear. Chop down some more trees. Oh, time for food. Okay, not amazing for our health, I understand, but at the moment, we're going to take what we got. Definitely need more wood. The long and winding cook. And this will help our health as well. There we go. As you can see, the flooding has already started. We are in no position at the moment to get going on our problems. We need that chimney. We don't have. I like the better boat, but I don't know if I'm in the position for the better boat either. While we're out here, we're not hurting for food, but this won't last forever. This is just a for now kind of thing. Alright, let's have a look at the better boat. Can't remember if it even needs the better machine. Ah, too many what ifs. that sticks palm frond for the lean to worth one? We got enough problems without things being only worth one. <laughs> Alright. Structures. Get another chest built. Armored boat. Lots of wood. Lots of shells don't really have on this run so far. Not ready. Would like to get that treasure though. Which is right there. Okay, let's get the treasure and call it for a day.
Did I leave my surfboard? It's right here. What happens? You just leave stuff out. Not even putting stuff away. We have the shovel. We can get this item. I'd like to check my map, but it's a little dangerous. All right, that's it. I'm checking the map. There we go. Without being hurt. Hooray. X marks the ground. See? And now we get the treasure. All right, what do we got in here? The vest, so we can't drown. <gasps> Gears! Amazing, I can make a fridge. Amazing, I can make a fridge. I have too much stuff on my body. What else do we got? Trawler's net. I don't know that one. I'll have to look it up. And the ball pin tuna, it will not go bad. So obviously that's amazing. And doubloons are amazing because of where we live. And another doubloons. Alright, before more bad stuff happens, I'm going back home for five seconds. I want that fridge. <laughs> I know, I know, I said we'd come here and then. But, uh, fridge... First, the life raft means I can't drown out here, and I will haul it back, but we're going to come out here with empty pockets. Ball pin tuna is food that won't expire. Oh, that is a travel disc. I'll have to take that at some point and see where that, that bad boy goes. Right now, we're just working on home. You'll forgive me if I don't want to immediately put up with more monkeys and wolves and stuff. So we're just going to hang tight before we beat those into the machine. And let's get a little bit more ready for the season before that. You can blame me for being a coward. But I killed two monkeys today. Pick that up. Alright, fridge time. Fridge. All I can remember is it takes stone. The rest is a little bit like and stuff. Okay, put the tuna away as well. Oh, ice box. Amazing. I love it. Oh, I love it. Fridge. All right. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop right here. I think this has been an unnaturally successful <laughs> round of this game. We have had some very weird stuff. Like, super duper weird stuff today. But I'd like to thank everyone for joining me for Don't Starve Shipwrecked with Gun Bunny. G-U-N-N -N Bunny. And despite my inability to successfully play this game, I hope we will get many more. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Goodbye.